Now, the GAI consortium is large. We've got 20 countries. We're growing. We're talking to other countries who are joining us. And um, our ambition is to cover the whole of Europe. The pilot studies, which you will hear more about shortly, um, have been undertaken in five countries, in Croatia, Finland, France, Ireland, and Slovenia. So I won't say anything more about that because that will be reported on. So we've been in existence for around about 10 years. Our first project, the MyWeb project, ran from 2014 to 2016. It established the feasibility and desirability of what is now Guide. And we've had a series of projects from then, building up, building up what we're doing. It's wrong to think of Guide as a project. It's bigger than a project. The ambition that we've got is large. It's it's so large that it can only really be understood as a research infrastructure. And that's why it takes time to develop. So this series of projects that we've got have taken to where we are today. We are here in Florence as part of the Coordinate project for which you can see we've got a couple of more years yet to run. The Coordinate project is drawing together uh, a community of people interested in child well-being, scientists, policymakers, um, NGOs as well as giving, providing the funding for the pilot study, which you'll be hearing more about later. There are further projects as well, um, which we have uh, in, in process, which are developing the research infrastructure. As this roadmap shows, we are now recognized by the European Union as a, a, a project which is an important research infrastructure developing what we're doing. Our ambition is in the near future to get the legal status which we will uh, which will give us the independence to operate as a research infrastructure and um, uh, invite members across Europe to join. We will be going into the field in 2027, as I said, and the data will be collected up until 2052, 2053. Again, an indication of the scope, the breadth, the depth of what we what it is that we're planning to do here. My final slide is just to uh, show that we are working alongside the established research infrastructures in Europe. Our final panel of the day includes representatives from SHARE, from the European Social Survey, and from the Generations and Gender Programme, as well as ourselves.